Uh, sweet baby elephants, what year is it? Power Rangers and Beauty and the Beast are in theaters and the Hardy Boys are tag team champions. What year is it? Is DDR2 going to make a comeback? No, I'm just being silly. It's time for Tech News on a Tuesday. <laughs> Do you have a Nintendo Switch? Do you like to play your Switch in dock mode? Well, stop it. You're only hurting yourself. And the Switch. Sort of. A bunch of Switch owners are coming out of the woodwork and saying that their Switches have warped due to playing the console in dock mode for too long. Rut row. It all started with a Reddit post from user underscore NSR who posted a picture of their warped system. Then more Redditors posted up pictures of their warped system and then a whole chain reaction. Underscore NSR did reach out to Nintendo and the support team said that they would get it repaired for him. Man, the month old console has seen a lot of problems first. The dock scratches the screen, then the Joy-Cons don't work properly, now warping? Gosh, what's next? The AI from Super Bomberman R gets super hard? All jokes aside though, at least Nintendo is responding if you reach their support team. So, thumbs up. A new patent from Apple has appeared and it looks like an old friend could be returning. Seems like Apple might be working on a magnetic charger dongle that uses MagSafe design. Basically, the patent image shows a magnetic power cord that fits into a rectangular dongle that plugs straight into the USB-C port. Maybe Apple finally heard the cries of all the new MacBook owners about not having a MagSafe power port. Hopefully, MacBook owners don't need to suffer much longer and Apple will start on production of this dongle ASAP. Hashtag dongle life. Hashtag raise your dongles. A researcher in Israel has uncovered 40 security holes in Samsung's Tizen operating system. The open source OS has been slowly making its way into devices like TVs and smartwatches over the last few years. The Israeli researcher told Motherboard that it's the worst code I've ever seen. He also said that you can see that nobody with any understanding of security looked at this code or wrote it. The biggest flaw is with the Tizen Store app. The software runs with the highest privileges you can get on a device, allowing hackers to deliver malicious code disguised as apps. It's like taking an undergraduate and letting him program your software, according to the researcher. That's what he said. This obviously is terrible news, considering that Samsung plans to have 10 million Tizen phones in the market this year. The research team is in contact with Samsung, so keep your fingers crossed that Samsung fixes all of these holes by plugging them with security. Oh snap, oh snap, oh snap, oh snap. It's time for <laughs> bim, 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 bim. lightning round. Palmer Lucky has left Facebook. A statement from Facebook thanks Lucky for helping building the VR industry and that they wish him all the best, but they don't give a reason as to why he left. Maybe he went to go get some milk and he never came back. According to news reports, Samsung's newest flagships, the S8 and S8 Plus, are not compatible with Google's Daydream VR. Well, that just seems like a huge oversight. BlackBerry may have plans to license their brand for new tablets, wearables, and appliances. Right, because back in 2011, the BlackBerry playbook did so well. Eurogamer tweeted out that they will have an exclusive Project Scorpio reveal on Thursday morning at 6 a.m. Pacific. And Transcend has launched their first NVMe SSD named the MTE850, which apparently gives the end user both speed and reliability. Sources for all today's news stories can be found in the NCX forum post linked down below. A bird called Flybird is a fly bird which flies when bird flies and eat fly while Flybird flies. Fly, fly, Flybird. Fly fly. And I, I added those last two fly flies. Not sure what you're trying to say though, but thanks for the submission, go pin nav. I hope I'm saying that right. If you have something random for us to say, tweet us with hashtag NCIX. Yo dog. Yo dog. Hey there folks, do you like snazzy t-shirts? I do too, like this one that I'm wearing. Where can you get it? At NCX.com, of course. We have four different designs and four different colors in a bunch of different sizes. Plus, you could save 15% on your car insurance. Wait, that's not right. You can save 15% when you buy two or more shirts. Official NCX Tech Tip shirts. 
only available at NZX.com. Click up here for more details. I don't know what that voice was. Well, all right, that's it for Netlink Daily. Thank you so much for watching. Click over here for previous videos and check us out on Twitter over there. But as always, like the video if you liked it, comment down below for fans with benefits, and subscribe for more videos like this from NCIX. See what I did there? Because it says NCIX on my shirt. You got it. On a Tuesday, got your girl in the gutter, she chooses a club going up.